yet another Antarctica shock having to do with new particles found. NASA scientists discovered ghost particles with a mysterious origin. This is by Sean Martin, Express UK, having to do with the details given to us by Science Alert. When physicists detected signals of high-energy neutrinos coming from a rather unlikely direction in the cosmos, they naturally went looking for a powerful source that might explain this. The intense examination of the most likely origins of these more reactive forms of ghost particles has now come up empty-handed, opening the way for more exotic speculations for what might be behind the odd signals. Trawling through seven years of data from the neutrino hunting ice cube experiment, and this uh, huge building that we see on the Antarctic ice is the ice cube observatory. So from their experiment, a large team of researchers from around the globe are now forced to admit conventional explanations for the discovery are looking very weak. Neutrinos are electron-like members of the standard model of fundamental particles. But unlike electrons, they have insanely small masses and they have no charge. This slim-bodied neutrality means neutrinos don't care to stop and chat with other particles. Atomic decay deep inside the sun sends torrents of them through the planet every single second, with only a fraction passing close enough to an atom to cause noticeable response. To catch a rare flash of a neutrino splashing into a frozen water molecule, the Ice Cube Observatory uses long strings of sensitive light capturing equipment buried under the Antarctica ice. For almost 10 years, it's been recording hundreds of flashes every day, building a vast database of information on the directions and energies of neutrinos washing over our Earth. Now, neutrinos are invisible yet highly energy, uh, energy, high energy particles, one of the fundamental ingredients of the universe. They don't know too much about them due to the fact that they rarely interact with other particles apart from when they collide head on. Neutrinos may hold some secrets in the history of the universe as when they do collide with other particles, a chain reaction occurs that lets scientists trace the neutrinos back to their original source. In this way, they unravel some of the mysteries of the universe. And they often pass through Earth, but because they are not influenced, they go undetected. The, their existence is a fundamental ingredient in the standard model of physics. Now, by trawling through the seven years of the observation from uh, Ice Cube and NASA's Antarctic Impulsive Transit Antenna, ANITA for short, a helium balloon which hovers above Antarctica Experts have discovered neutrinos which hit the Earth, yet they still cannot explain them or where they come from, where they originate. Astrophysicist Alex Pizzuto from the University of Wisconsin-Madison said, It's commonly said that neutrinos are elusive or ghostly particles because of their remarkable ability to pass through material without smashing into something. But at, at these incredible energies, neutrinos are like bulls in a china shop. They become much more likely to interact with particles in Earth. But scientists can't rule out that this is a chance encounter, but it's more likely a bundle of neutrinos hit our planet in one go, and just a few were detected. And the result was the team looked for a source of the neutrinos, but the results were inconclusive. The statement from Ice Cube said, in all three searches, they found no evidence for a neutrino source in the direction of the strange Anita events. And this particle, particularly intriguing because due to the process called tau neutrino regeneration, the extremely high energy events that don't make it all the way to Anita should still be detectable by Ice Cube. Anastasia Barbano, University of Geneva, Switzerland, led uh, uh, another lead uh, on the paper published in the Astrophysical Journal said, this process makes Ice Cube a remarkable tool to follow up the ANITA observations because for each anomalous event that ANITA detects, Ice Cube should have detected many, many more, which in this case we did not. That means that we can rule out the idea that these events came from some intense point source 
because the odds of Anita seeing an event and Ice Cube not seeing anything are so slim. With no explanation of their origin, researchers believe they could have to rethink the standard model, and Pusito says our analysis ruled out the only remaining standard model astrophysical explanation of the anomalous Anita events. So now, if these events are real, and not just due to oddities in the detector, then they could be pointing to physics beyond the standard model. If you'd like to join me on my Patreon account, you will hear content not covered by mainstream media. These riveting stories will be based on my research and I will state my opinions and give my personal insight on diverse and controversial subjects and world events, events not covered by mainstream media and not certainly on not supported by YouTube guidelines. So whatever I have on my Patreon, most of those will not be on my YouTube channel. Please consider becoming a member today. More of the, the most significant and important videos will be on my Patreon channel. Your support helps me to continue my research and keeps this YouTube channel alive. And we depend on your support, your generous charity, because we help economically challenged families here in Athens, Greece, in Kapota, and we also help the young generation with university tuition and the community around our church. Thank you.